Hi, welcome to Minijack. Uh, this episode is just to uh, present and explain this little new series that will exist inside of uh, Minijack. It's Minijam, and it's as the name says, uh, there are going to be very small uh, gems gem sessions using um, new instruments and new combinations I am experimenting on. So it's uh, completely in the field of strange things and not always completely working. Uh, some of them are ideas I'm working on for future instruments and uh, different things you, you will see and you will hear. Uh, for example, the the last, uh, the, the, the first actually, uh, mini jack, uh, mini gem, uh, used this uh, little thing, which is uh, just a wood block with uh, with a nail on it, which acts as a as a sensor basically, because I am I connected it in the in the matrix mixer. And I'm using the voltage generated by my touch. Uh, I am amplifying it with the uh, with the gain, and it activates an oscillator. You see the the, the orange LED. And if I uh, keep my pressure, the oscillator just keeps going. And of course, I, I can change the sound of. With this setup, um, I, I will record, I think, two or three mini gems. So what are you going to hear in the future will be based on this same setup. This is a new matrix mixer I've been working on and my client has have been very, very kind to give me some time to record a demo and the mini gem. So thank you, Emilio. This is an active uh, matrix 8x8, eight eight, so 64 little knobs, uh, plus 1. So this is um, an auxiliary out, which is a copy of the last line. And you have a supplementary uh, volume. So you, you can double the gain, actually. In the whole matrix, the gain is 2.2. What I always like and uh, advise people to choose because it's a little bit more than double and it's very useful. So when when you use this one, it's actually 4.5 if you use it all, all the way. And this is the new case design. Everything is uh, hand built, and uh, it has uh, wooden wooden sides and uh, aluminium uh, face plates. And in this particular model, uh, we have both uh, quarter inch jack and mini jacks, so you can use uh, you, you can always use a quarter jack or mini jack without using any adapter. For example, in these inputs I am using uh, mini jacks and here I am using uh, quarter inch jacks uh, just without any problem. And yeah, there is also some uh, improvement in the power supply. Now it has a, a protection and a supplementary filter, so it's very, very quiet. But yeah, Let's get to, to the structure of this uh, setup. Here I have um, five uh, square wave uh, oscillators. They're all based on uh, 555 uh, timer chips. The, the first and second one, actually also the third, are just uh, simple oscillators, just with uh, different uh, speeds, as we can see. Uh, different speed ranges. Uh, if I give voltage, they just yeah, they oscillate at different speeds. And um, 
almost always a uh, sub uh, audio so it's uh, what we can hear are the the clicks of the transient going up and down the wave and this other one is just uh, another simple oscillator with a space mark ratio which is you are going to see and give it voltage it's very steep basically it it is uh, almost always on. The yellow LED shows when the when the status is high and the, the red when it is low. So as you can see, it's mostly high. It's always a square wave. Uh, while the, the last oscillator uh, is, um, is with a variable, uh, space mark uh, ratio and we can adjust it with a little knob here so you can see now it's smaller mark is smaller now it's bigger and actually i have this uh, hooked up in the in my oscilloscope so we can see it this is a small mark this is a smaller mark actually yeah this one was the big one yeah i don't know if it's really possible to see it in the video because the frequency is pretty high maybe i can yeah Not like this yeah so like this is smaller and bigger and we we can see it in in the led flashing and basically uh, all the um, oscillators are VCOs, so vo voltage controlled. Uh, all their control inputs are connected to the outputs of the metrics and all the outputs of the oscillators are connected in the inputs of uh, the metrics. So I can interconnect any, any of them. Uh, while in the middle I have um, a graphic equalizer and a big math overdrive so basically in these two channels i have the ins and these two i have the outs so visually there is a big cross in the middle of the matrix that is uh, managing the, um, the 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 two pedals and the rest is oscillators uh, this is oscillators to, to themselves this is oscillators to the others and the opposite here is here to themselves and here to the others and well uh, in a lot of the um, mini gems i will be working with the resonance uh, as the patch you were hearing before which was yeah something like this for example, here I have just uh, a, a click going uh, going in, and it's uh, resonating uh, a feedback loop uh, formed by the big math and the uh, graphic equalizer. If if I put it up too much, it just fits back. But here. can change the sound very delicate uh, balance and well i think that's it i hope you will like the new mini gems i managed to to keep them quite short so will be some glimpses of uh, new things and it's it's just time when when the time will come 
new things will unravel and be developed and become new instruments, new melodies, new noises, basically, and the usual stuff that that you know and then you have been used to. So yeah, that's it basically. If if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more videos.